it going, YouTubers and Twitch streamers? My name is Farrington Empire, and I'm here with another review, more of a first look at uh, a game that's been on Steam for a little while called Vangers, and this has actually been uh, released um, before. Um, it was originally released in 1998, and then was re-released to uh, Steam in 2008, about 10 years later. So, let's hop right into it. Alrighty, so, as you can see, the textures have been updated a little bit here, but I'm just going to go ahead and hop right in. I've never actually played this game before, so I'll make that perfectly clear. <laughs> going into this blind. So, we're going to play this for a little bit, um, and I will give you some thoughts as we uh, hop straight into it. So, let's do it. Uh, let's start a new game. Dead music, though. Achtung! Wenger is approaching. Okay, here we go. My goodness. Welcome back, poor pill garlic. We thought you were completely dead. Have to give an another one away. Interesting. Okay. Uh oh. Oh, I see. Ah! Where are my guns? Where are my guns? Do you have key bindings? No. Okay. Uh, let's see here. Number pad, nothing. Okay. Oh. Okay, that does that. Oh my goodness. I'm dying lots and lots. I'm just trying to escape. That 3D effects though. Oh, I don't think I have a weapon yet. I'm so confused. I have to follow the... Oh, okay. I see now. That shows my proximity. Gotta follow my compass bug! I wish I could tell you what I knew- or if, like, that I knew what I was doing. I'm being chased by these things that apparently know what they're doing. Um... Which is trying to kill me. There. I just went in with somebody else. I see our talks are not in vain, Vanger. You brought us phlegma. We Ellie Pods would like to wallow in it. This is the trippiest thing I've ever seen. I have nothing to say, Fitter. Leave me alone. I'm busy. Okay. So I can get a new vehicle now. Okay. With a new gun. But I can't afford... Okay. Can I sell that? Yeah! Alright! Making money! Okay, cool. How much is this? 5,000. I see. So this is the... Okay. Nimbos. Alrighty. Let's throw that down there. Let's get a couple of these guys. Okay. Now... There! Now I have a gun! Ha ha! Alright. 50 shots. Okay. Uh, I feel like I'm getting somewhere. 
to Gorb Gear. Oh man, that's awesome. I don't know what, to, what I'm doing. I'm so confused, Frostfroll. What? We're in Frostfroll right now. Our world. You won't understand what I mean until you learn the nature of ch of the chain. Now go and touch Frostfroll. Your Mechos is waiting. Okay, here we go again. Completely and entirely clueless as to what we're doing. Okay, so that kind of launches you. This game is so hard. The learning curve on this game is so absurd, purely because of the complete, complete lack of a tutorial. Complete lack of explanation as to what you're doing here, other than very vaguely written existential writing at the very top of the game. I don't think that this is a game that I can really continue playing. I admire the fact that they are doing re-releases. From good old games, they're re-releasing them on Steam. I love that they're trying to put new texture packs on things to make them look prettier. I think that's very cool. I think that this game... I have a feeling that what you're trying to do is a little lost in... A little lost in a language barrier. Uh, and if it's not a language barrier, then it was just poorly written. Spiral Discharge passage closed. This game is treating me as though I should know how to play this from the very, very beginning in terms of how it works, everything. So, from what I can get off of the wiki, this is one of the first games to really have uh, destroyable terrain. So as you play, the terrain will change, and I did notice that a bit in the game. And for something that came out in 1998, that's uh, Bird's Eye View with mild 3D like this has, I can respect it for that. I really can. Um, it sounds like the game doesn't even really quite know what it is. It sounds like you have several different main caterpillars. So there's... They're gonna, and they have to complete quests for them, which are poorly defined, uh, to bring them things that they want that use words that aren't a thing. <laughs> I, it just does not have enough narrative and doesn't have enough guidance. I don't need my hand to be held, but at the beginning, straight out of the gate, it would be nice to have a little bit of hand holding so that I know at least what I'm supposed to do. Instead of dropping me off in the middle of the world, not telling me what buttons do what, and just allowing me to be about my own devices. So, with that, with that bombshell, uh, I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to say I'm not a huge fan of Vangers, and uh, I appreciate I appreciate being uh, given a copy to review. Uh, I'm sorry that it's not one of my favorite games. Um, I think in terms of an early 2008, uh, early 2008 as opposed to late 2008, as a 2008 release. Um, for a game that would have been played on DOS, um, I think it's I think it's a, a, a decent 3D game that really explores um, destro uh, destroyable textures. I did notice that there used to be uh, through reading about the game here, uh, there used to be a multiplayer functionality where you could play against your friends in kind of a battle mode. However, with the port over to um, Steam, this has been lost, so you can no longer play with friends, which I think would be the only redeeming quality for this game, in my opinion, is is getting a big group of individuals together, either uh, on a server or in a LAN, to kind of run around to different bases, rig up your trucks, your vehicles, your vangers, and um, going head-to-head -head against them. I think that would be, I think that would be entertaining. The thing is, it's just, it's lost here, and with little to no explanation, it's hard for me to get into it. So, uh, that was Vangers, and uh, we'll see you guys in the next review. As always, I've been Farrington Empire. You guys have been absolutely fantastic. Do remember to uh, like, rate, and subscribe. Tweet this out to your friends. Let them know what we're doing here. Make sure you subscribe to uh, the Rise Up Gaming YouTube page, as well as my own personal page, which is official Farrington Empire, um, which you can find right here on YouTube. Link in the description. Please do swing back by for the next review, which should be up in just a couple days. So, that was Vangers. I've been Farrington Empire. Have a wonderful evening. Good night.